Here's a quick overview of the true core of FocusPulling.com, the camera user groups. And at the top middle, there is a flyout menu where you can pick the camera that you want. In this case, we're using as a sample the Blackmagic Cinema Camera user group. And there you see the most recent videos arranged in a grid, and you can click on them and watch them. But at the top of the group, there's a banner where if you click on it, it takes you to the Vimeo user group associated with the website. And if you haven't joined it yet, you click the Join This Group button and log in if you hadn't logged in yet. And then what you'll want to do is go to one of your clips shot with a Blackmagic camera in this example and go to the settings so that you'll be able to add tags. Tags are important to identify Blackmagic or in this case BMPC because then it authenticates the clip for the brief approval queue. It's not a foolproof way to ensure that cameras match the user groups, but it's the best way we've got. The next stage is to go to the Collections button on your own clip and to choose the user group that you just joined or had already joined that is associated with the website. Next, if the tags you entered match the camera's user group, that's good enough for me to be able to approve it, not instantly, but not long. And then it'll show up inside the user group as part of the stream. Heading back to the website, you'll notice that each user group has its own associated Facebook and Twitter feed. So after your clip makes it into the user group, it will be sent out to those streams prefaced by new video for more exposure and interaction with other users. So thanks for learning how this feature works, which gets easier after the first time you hook in. Because after this, it's just a matter of two steps. Tag your clip and check the box. And that's how the camera user groups work, the core of the site. So you could stop here, but if you have another minute, I'll spend that time quickly going over some of the features at the newfocuspulling.com. From the front page, where Featured Articles stream, you can find a lot of information about the site's layout and features by going to the top middle menu button that says About. It walks you through the what, where, who, why, and how of the site. To the right of that, you can access a fun social feature called Rig Shots, which is best explained by reading the information at that page. Then to the right of that, the menu item DocoFilm, which really takes you to an embedded website, docofilm.com, that's part of the Focus Pulling family, bringing together onto one page a digest of news from the world of documentary filmmaking. And lastly, there's a page called Adobe Premiere Tips about the video editing program that speaks for itself. The sidebar, usually visible wherever you are at the site, has search boxes, links to favorite retailers, and social media buttons to make our interactions more convenient. Finally, you can always sign up at the sidebar with your email address to receive no more than one email per week with a digest of the blog activity at the site.